Now, in this video, we are going to study about optimum design. Now, this is the part of first module that is a methodology and morphology. Now, what is meaning of optimum design? Now, as the word says, optimum, that we have to find a particular solution. Now, what it is exactly? Now, if we have multiple options, and out of that, we have to choose for the best one that is called as optimum. Similarly, if we we'll go with the technical things, the optimum design is the process of selecting the best possible design which satisfy the criteria among many feasible designs or many feasible solutions. So if we have a particular products which are having variety of 10 things or 10 designs, so out of that 10 designs, we are going to select only one or only the best one which designs or which fulfills our all criteria. Now, next point is design of complex system requires large calculations often repetitively for various combinations of design variables. Now, if we take for example of a larger machine like suppose jet engine of a plane. Now, in that we have various complication things. So each and every time you can't change any simple dimension and you can't change it each and everything with that. So here we are having large calculations of stress, strength, its visibility, its safety. So there are a lot of things of it. So we can't do it manually. Now for this, uh, for this we are having multiple softwares which use which are used to analyze all those things so we it is very complex system which requires a very large calculation and it is a repetitive one now suppose any one component is failed so you have to change each and everything as per that component or which is related to that component so that makes this all things complex so to avoid that we are going to study this now here to avoid this confusion, we can give this task to automatic system like computer. So instead of doing it manually, we can use simply softwares which can easily process all this data and those will give us the maximum possible and best solution. Now for getting all those things in the exact manner, we have some softwares that is artificial neural network ANN, genetic algorithm, particle swap optimization. So these are few softwares or these are few methods which we use it for getting optimum design. Now what exactly is done in optimum design? Now in case of optimum design, the desirable effects are maximized and the undesirable effects are minimized means what whatever we want that is maximized and whatever we don't want in the system that is minimized simply what we want it we want more safety more strength and what we don't want the simple failure so the failure part is minimized and the success success or success part that is increased now for optimization the minimization parameter are the cost, the weight, the size, stress, deflection, etc. And the maximum parameters or the maximizing parameters are capacity, load carrying capacity, and energy storage capacity. Now, if we check it, now how we can minimize the thing? That we can minimize its weight by using different material, similarly with the size. We can minimize the stress acting on the frame, we can minimize the deflection, we can minimize its cost. Then what should be the maximizing parameters? The maximizing parameter, its power transmitting capacity, its load carrying capacity and its energy storing capacity. So these are the things, those are considered in optimum design and to the particular, all those points and using softwares or using these methods we can check it that which is the best method. 